guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the finale of Monthly Girls Nozaki Kun. I am excited slash sad because these are the last two episodes of the show, even though I still have the OVAs to watch after, but I mean, OVAs are just OVAs. It's like a six episode OVA and I'm like it's not the same I'm like it's just an original animated video and possibly how much is it going to be canon to the original series so I mean I don't know it's just gonna be sad because probably either this week or next week I should be watching it but yeah you might be seeing me cry during this last episode when I get to episode 12 but other than that let's go ahead and get started with episode 11 and three two one go there we go. And he's much better than what's his face. Isn't he right about that, Sakura? I would have never thought that. I was thinking that he was like maybe in his late 30s to almost 40s, maybe. Yeah, I mean, you would think he would just be the same way he is now. <laughs> Social distancing. No, Saki. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Who would have thought that in the end, yeah, they've gotten along? <laughs> It's his job to know your characters, to say which characters need the main focus and which ones don't at the time. I love you, baby boy. You are so fucking precious. <laughs> He's like, what's her face from Comic Girls? Oh my god. I don't remember her name. <laughs> the pink hair and I my precious baby who I love and adore and I wanna fucking protect. <laughs> uh. Oh my god, this boy. <laughs> Oh, 
That's nice. Okay, you want to do something that'll spice it up. You want to go take a walk or go see, do something fun. Yeah, that's a little too exciting and deadly, though. Oh, gee. No, this ain't the, um... Mm-hmm. Like a little too much close-ups, yeah. It's going to be him as her chair. It is. I know it is. Mm -hmm. Now sit down. <laughs> it's cute though.
It's just rice. Oh, it's curry! Lunch date. <laughs> I know. We stand. We stand. <laughs> oh, no. Can we just say? No, Zach, you will make the best fucking husband. Oh my god. That's what I want in a man. Mm -hmm. We take turns making dinner for each other. We cook together. Oh my god. Nothing out of the ordinary. I hate the sound of those bugs. That's how you know it's truly summer. Really? No surprises or anything? No <laughs> I'm hungry. Uh, did you see how much I'm hungry? That was like, what, three hours ago? having a boys night. This is what I needed. <laughs> you don't get along, me God, you need to be okay. Walk is just, you know, a ball of sunshine. Yeah. 
But Christian is bound to find out sooner or later, right? I mean, we got one more episode left. <laughs> left. <laughs> and she knows that you've been looking at his manga. Oh, God. Her and her harem. really coming down, isn't it? My God. <laughs> it is. <laughs> no, let's just watch TV. That's not anime. Uh, oh, there we go. I knew that was coming. Like, like a dirty magazine. No, 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 no. Not a mommy ho. A dirty magazine. A porno magazine. Something. Yes. Oh, God. I know. Night. When the hell are all y'all gonna sleep though? I knew that for the reason why, of course. Nozaki's intentions. That's the only reason why he did it. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Nothing more is <isn't> but What we normally do at sleepovers is not only talk, we play games, sometimes we watch some movies, 
Um, we bake stuff, mainly like either cookies or brownies or like both. Anything sweet, because you know, when it's a girl sleepover, we want fucking munchies. And mm, when, it's an old, when it's an adult sleepover, you can have wine and alcohol. That's the best thing ever. But you drink in moderation, just saying. Oh, Waka, you've already met her. You just don't know. Can you even lift her? Are y'all literally gonna arm wrestle just to see who the fuck is gonna pick him up? Boys. Just all pick them up at the same time. It makes you wonder what time it is. Also, can we just talk about how cute Nozaki looked when he was sleeping? Oh my god. But the fact is, like, he didn't want those three to sleep, and he was the first one to fall asleep. Oh my god, that was so fucking cute. But mm, I wanted him to, like, stay up with the boys and literally talk about, like, each girl and what they thought about them. Because typically, okay, as a woman, uh, when you have sleepovers with other girls and you're literally talking about, like, your crushes, it's, oh my god, it's just, it, see, it's good when it's, like, a celebrity crush or, like, a guy from your high school or whatever, but when it's anime crushes, oh my god. This is when the girl, when the females, maybe when the, the dudes do this, I don't know, but that's when we go in and we're like, no, your husbando is not better than my husbando. Like, shut the F up. Like, no, my husbando is the God said, God tier man of all men in anime. Like, I'm sorry. Like, no one is going to compare. I mean, if like I had a conversation with most of my girlfriends because I, I still sometimes have conversations like this with some of them. And we usually end up having, like, this cute little bickered argument because we're just trying to figure out which anime guy is better than one. And then just, like, mm, who's the one who that you would marry? Who's the one that you would fuck? And who's the one that you would kill? That's usually how it goes sometimes. We just pick random anime guys or just random celebrities or anything and just be like, yeah, just pick one. But it was cute! Aww. I thought she would have framed it. Excuse me. The chocolate? Oh. Oh. The fat. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see that? Even though I was trying to say, I love the fact that the freaking characters of Nosaki's manga. 
I'm the one doing the narration for the last thing in the episode. Oh my god. But no, did you see no lucky? <laughs> <laughs> It might happen. I don't think it is, but oh my god, I'm gonna I'm gonna be a little hopeful, a little hopeful. Prayers up in this like Let's go. Oh my god, if he kisses her, oh, this might be maybe one of my favorite kisses. Like oh god, I mean, mm, like please, please. Oh my god. Even though it's probably not gonna happen, it could be like a freaking dream sequence, but like. Oh, baby, the fact that she lit the chocolate and everything, and then it goes back to, like, throw back to episode one when she confessed and everything, like, ah, I can't, my heart. But, yes, to have the boys have a sleepover was awesome, because, honestly, I really wanted mainly all the male characters of the show to have, like, a situation where they were all hanging out and doing something together. Same thing with the girls in this show, because really it's mainly, like, the guys mostly, or sometimes it is either Sakura and Nozaki plus a couple of others, so it usually is sometimes a double date, even though it's not really a date, though, but still, to just have the guys hang out in one episode and the girls hang out in another would be interesting, but I'm guessing we're about to have the best group date ever, ever possibly. I don't even, I can't even speak right now, like, Oh, but it's gonna be the best group day ever. It better be. I swear to God, this is the last episode for Christ's sake, and I cannot wait to see what in the world is gonna happen. That kiss better be real. I swear to God, if it's not, we're gonna have problems. But other than that, go ahead and pause the video, and I will see you guys in one second for the final episode. <laughs> okay, final episode in three, two, one, go. Hmm. Want to cry? <laughs> but no. But if, what if it's true love? Like, come on. Think about it. What if it's true love? <laughs> I'm gonna miss the shit out of this song. Oh my god, because this song would always get me so hyped for an episode. <laughs> Whether it's this version or the popping party cover. <laughs> yeah. Let's just say it's complicated. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> she even ran. <laughs> Poor baby. Of course, so he can get stuff for his manga. Mm hmm. Well, damn. Because that, you know what? Honestly, that's kind of true, especially with American holidays. After Valentine's Day, if you go into any other holiday, you go to Walmart, you go to Target, everything is all bland. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was really only for the research, though. Mm -hmm. Of course. Please tell me the truck didn't drive away. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, of course. Oh, that is such lies. Oh, flashback. Yeah. Uh huh. I mean, that's a decent reaction. It could have been better, but hey. <laughs> You can do it. Mm -hmm. I want chocolate. No, 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 no. Oh, God. Please don't. Please no. No, 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 no. Yeah. 
Yeah. Go get you some better chocolate and you guys share it. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Big misunderstanding. It's okay. She wasn't looking. You go to dinner. Then it fell. It's okay. No five second rule or anything. Throw the chocolates away. Get a brand new pair and just eat them together. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but have you gotten better though? Yeah, come on, let's hear it. Yeah, it'll be fun. Jesus, I, I really wouldn't want to go over there. But me got me a little too handsome. I know. It's so cute. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> well, mainly guys just like to wear regular clothes. Most guys, but I mean, <laughs> some girls don't want to wear you got them. And Nozaki will be wearing, both of these two will be wearing their school uniforms. Mm. Mm -mm. Of course, that's the only reason why you're there, getting that reference. <laughs> Baby Waka, it's just a big old misunderstanding once again. Right. Have fun.
Usually. I, I've seen that in other animes, but... <laughs> Oh, but she's there. You could have came with her like a day. <laughs> Thank you for the email, Uber Eats. Okay. You were just there at the right moment. Hmm. Uh oh. Nozaki. Finally, we're going to get that kiss. We're going to get that kiss. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god Hmm. You could ask for help. That's what she knew. She was in love with him. I'm like, yeah. Oh, you know, I can't. My heart. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. No, 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 no. He's, he's just big and busy with the manga. Manga. Manga.
<laughs> that episode with the bite. You guys running in the rain in episode nine was, was <laughs> so adorable. That moment with the curry and walking home together only oh <laughs> them chopping at the mall and the the ladies thinking that they were a couple. But they were just just there for cosplay. Mm -hmm. I, I think he heard you, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what he's saying. <laughs> Okay, final thoughts on this show. I, to finally be able to watch this series after wanting to watch it for the longest time, I am happy I was able to watch this with you guys, even though, yeah, I still got one more thing to do, but mm, it was so good. It was everything I wanted and more, and I'm so glad I was able to watch this. And the funny thing is, I went on Netflix last night just to go, and I forgot that it was officially now on Netflix as of yesterday. And now I can rewatch it anytime I want to. But I think the feelings and everything that I had, I kind of wish I could just erase my memory and just rewatch it all over again. Kind of how I feel with most shows that I watch the first time that I end up falling in love with by the time I'm done with the show, whether it's 12 episodes, 13, 14, 24, 26 episodes, or it's something that is a span for years. You end up falling in love with it. And it was good. I love these characters. It makes me wonder what could possibly be in store for the future for these characters. And if Nozaki and Sakura get together. Because that's all I really want at the end of the day. For them to get together. Because they're so fucking adorable. And I love them so freaking much. And I want him to kiss her. Please. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Precious boy, we love you. I'm not going to count that as a confession, but in a way it kind of is, but it's so cute though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's pretty. That was so cute. Oh my god, I can't. Mm -mm. I'm just so glad I finally was able to watch this because this has been on my list for the longest time. This and Sweetness and Lightning have like always been on there, like in the back of my mind. No matter how many people ask me, like, Queen Deja, can you watch this? Queen, can you watch this? Queen, watch this. This seems interesting. Yada, yada, so forth and um, so on and so forth. 
but this show and Sweetness and Lightning have been like the top two shows that I have been wanting to watch for the longest time. With the fact is like with Sweetness and Lightning, I see that ish on Twitter like all the time. Like Crunchy will possibly put something about it, um, or somebody would post like a scene or a video or whatever, and I keep reminding myself I need to watch that because I want to watch that because everybody has said such good things about that show and this show. But oh my god. I just don't really want to read the manga, but then, I mean, I just want to see how in the world this show ends in the manga. And then, since next week that I'm also watching the OVAs, and probably, like I said in the previous video, the OVAs are not really going to be maybe canon. Sometimes they are, sometimes they aren't, but no matter what happens, I'm going to be super excited because then that'll be, you know, my final, what, thoughts on them. Um their last appearances and everything, even though this is my final thoughts and everything, but it was such a good show. I just want everybody who is coupled with someone by the end of the series or however, wherever the manga went, who knows if they're all together. That's all I really want to know with it at the end of the day. If certain characters are with other certain characters, because I mean, you can't deny the chemistry that Sakura and Nozaki have. Um, Yuzu and Waka or Hiyori, and um Kashima because like oh my god they're just amazing Mikorin even though Mikorin didn't have like a love interest in a way he still had himself at the end of the day I feel like maybe um possibly in the manga there is someone for him but I'm guessing maybe at the time when they were animating this I don't know how much um or how far the manga was per take to the anime and sometimes when you're doing a show that is like somewhat close like you get an anime only ending and then the manga keeps going and then by the time the anime catches up again you're in a situation and the next thing you know um something happens and they don't want to continue the anime and then maybe like several years down the line five ten years maybe 20 years later they're like hey why don't we go ahead and finish that anime that we never finished you know I'm just saying. I mean, they're currently doing that with Bleach, and I'm so excited because my favorite arc is finally going to be animated, and I can't wait to see it. Because that's next year, and that's going to be the best year ever. Even though, like, most of the shows that I was really excited for this year all got delayed, delayed to next year, which is okay. It's fine, but it's still sad at the same, at the same freaking time. But, yeah. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction view to the series of Monthly Girls Nozaki Kun. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for the OVAs. And then I really don't know what in the world I'm going to watch next, honestly. Um, I still have Patreon shows to do and requests for those because those are, like, on my top tier list right now. Um... But whenever I find something that seems interesting to me, whether it's something I wanted to watch on my list or something out of the ordinary that, you know, it just comes out of nowhere. And it's like, hey, that seems interesting. Possibly that's when the next time you guys will see me. But until then, I will see you guys all next Friday. Bye, guys.